This next exercise is the mini band hip external rotation. So if you watch the clamshell exercise, this is gonna be very similar to the clamshell exercise, but we're gonna do it standing in a squat position. We're gonna work the same muscles in the same movement. Now what this exercise does is it works the abductors and hip external rotators, but it does so in a standing position. So there's gonna be a different type of stress to the muscles around your spine and around your hips. So I'm gonna show you the exercise, a few reps of the exercise, and I'm gonna break it down step by step so you can get the most out of doing this exercise. Okay, so let's talk about how to do this exercise. First thing that you need to do is you need to choose the proper resistance band. What I recommend, like all the other exercises, is that you start with a lighter band. So since it's your legs, your legs are gonna be stronger muscles, you might wanna start off not with the lightest, but the next lightest band. This is actually a heavy band that I'm using. So after you choose the band and you learn how to do the, uh, after you choose the band, now you're gonna put it on. Now I'm sitting on the floor, but probably the best thing to do is to sit on a bench or sit on some type of stool so that you can put this on one leg at a time easily. And you want it just above your knees. So after you stand up, you want the band just above your knees. You don't want it at your knees and you don't want it up too high. You want it just above your knees. The next thing you're gonna do is that you're gonna take a squat position. You're gonna bring your feet apart. Like if you were gonna do a nice squat position. And the next thing you're gonna do after that is you're gonna get into the squatted position. Now the band is pulling my knees in right now. So the exercise is squatting down into this position and then externally rotating your knees out. So pulling the band apart using your knees. And what is this doing? It's working the muscles of your hips. And you want to get into that position where your knees are really out. And really feeling a strong contraction in your hip muscles as you bring your knees all the way out. The last pointer here is that I'm doing this without any shoes on. It's better if you can do it without shoes because shoes alter the mechanics of how your foot works, which alters the mechanics of how every other thing up from your foot works. So if you can do this exercise barefoot like I'm doing right now, do it barefoot. Otherwise, okay, if you're in a gym and you can't take your shoes off, no problem. But this is something that you wanna make sure that you do with no shoes if you can. So that's how you do the mini band standing hip external rotation exercise.